Morning. <clears throat> oh, oh, that's a very smart camera. Yeah, Nearly got me with the microphone thing though, I had to mind my head. Yeah. So you mentioned previously about the story of Marcus and Lisa, sir. Yeah. And in that you mentioned someone had a heart attack. What, what was that about? Sir? Oh yeah. That was a heart attack. The heart attack was oh, terrible for the allotment that was. Terrible. Apparently his wife had only left him a couple of weeks ago. Oh, he was a very naive man. But uh, his wife changed him into something a bit different. Yeah, this is the story of Abid and Samina. about two weeks ago when my wife Samina finally decided to leave me. It's tragic because it seemed to hurt the people around me like my mum and dad more. More than it did to me. Are you jealous of me, Abid, or what? Am I too independent for you? Maybe I'm earning too much money? I don't think you've given yourself a second to think. It's like I'm saying one thing, you're thinking the other. <laughs> I really can't deal with your shit, Abid. I just can't win sometimes. Oh, don't be ridiculous, Samina. You always win! I won't deny we had a share of happy memories. Our fights. Grown man and a fucking security guard. You want to look after somebody? Why don't you try looking after yourself? I've got better things to say than repeating your name in various other ways, Samina. I know you want to work in Qatar, but don't bring him along. Please. Samina, I'm begging you. I need him too. Why do you need him so bad? I lost the piano she made me play. Everything I had. Taking him away from me. <sighs> I've got nothing left. I want to take responsibility over. The worst thing is, my little boy will never know how much I fought for him. And every second I'm alive, I'm ashamed of myself. Samina, stay for a while, yeah? I'll put the kettle on, we'll, we'll have some chai and we'll talk this over. Move out of my way, Albert, I'm asking you politely. I don't want another fight. I'm gonna kill you, Samina! I'm gonna kill you and then I'm gonna kill myself! Do you hear me? I'm gonna 
and kill myself. Do you hear me? You're a grown man and a fucking security guard. You want to look after somebody? Why don't you try looking after yourself? You're jealous of me, Arbid, or what? Am I too independent for you? Maybe I'm earning too much money? Don't think you've given yourself a second to think. It's like I'm saying one thing, you're thinking the other. <laughs> I really can't deal with your shit, Arbid. I just can't win sometimes. Don't be ridiculous, Samina. You always win! security guard. You want to look after somebody? Why don't you try looking after yourself? I've got better things to say than repeating your name in various other ways. I know you want to work in Qatar. Don't bring him along. Stay for a while, yeah? I'll put the kettle on. We'll, we'll have some chai and we'll talk this over. Do that, but wait, Ovid. I'm asking you politely. I don't want another fight. I'm gonna kill you, Samina! I'm gonna kill you and then I'm gonna kill myself! Do you hear me? second I'm alive. I'm ashamed of myself. 